Okay, so this is the backyard. So this is the back side of the house. And then there's the back door. So from there I've got um, some succulents and my little solar lights. This was already here. And I've got some more succulents in here. And it gets kind of shady on this side for a minute. It's about um, 11 o'clock in the morning. And uh, it's still been getting below freezing, but it's been getting up to the mid-60s during the day. Um, so along here I've got some more succulents and then some daisies. More daisies. And then there's some bulbs there. Some more bulbs and daisies there. There's some irises here and some other bulbs some more daisies and then just got some calendula in the ground so it's really hard to see because it's kind of dark but this will get afternoon sun and then yeah okay and then uh, this is more succulents and the thyme and lavender will go next to it and then toward the front this will all be garden boxes. Pick up. Mommy. These will all be garden boxes through here. And we got one out there. I'll take it. I take it. Okay. Um, there's one over here that's uh, six feet or eight feet by. It's either six or eight by two and a half. And um, so then we'll have three other boxes that are two foot by four foot boxes all along this edge um, and then eventually this will get filled in with more boxes as the longer we live here. Up here I plan on doing strawberries all along that bottom edge. Right now it's just bark and moss and rock. Up on the post, on every post there's going to be a hanging basket and or a bucket and that will have like tomatoes or peppers or eggplant something like that that we can do upside down and then along this that's more of where that same bed was and then along here it get, doesn't get any sun in that corner at all right now but it's still only March so along here we're eventually gonna do probably some blueberries um, we'll do some ground cover of some kind and um, maybe peas up the wall not quite sure yet. Over here we're going to do some in-ground um, planters. So there'll be three containers that are about a uh, foot in diameter, two feet in diameter, one, two, and three. And then they'll have something. So at a ground level you won't see that it's in a container. And then uh, this will be raised up into another garden bed for vegetables and then something in that planter and then we'll kind of fill in the miscellaneous spots as we have things to fill in. So that's the garden update for now. This is kind of just a shade bed because as far as I understand it doesn't get sun at all. So what can grow is moss. Anyway, that's the garden.